My name's Steve Foley. I'm the consultant neurologist here at the Royal Berkshire Hospital in Reading. I've been here a consultant 10 years and I mainly look after ladies with bladder dysfunction and a lot of stress urinary incontinence in uh, female patients. Typically my day would consist of looking after 20 to 30 ladies uh, with this problem and we would operate on about 20 to 30 per week uh, once we'd seen them in clinic. The typical patient I have is a 45 to 65 year old lady who has a degree of incontinence which is starting to impact on her quality of life. She's stopping her doing things she wants to do, either go to the gym, enjoy playing with the children or the grandchildren, and it's time now to do something about it. It's time for her to think of herself and looking after herself. I've been using the Deflux product here at the Royal Berkshire for over 10 years because we're really impressed with how the product reacts with the patient. I normally quote 70% uh, success uh, for patients on a single injection. There's no long-term complications and anything that does occur we can easily sort out. The problem with uh, patients with incontinence is the muscle itself has become weak and it's become slightly open and then for when they exercise or cough or sneeze because it's slightly open they with a leakage of urine. The injection therapies, we look in with the telescope and we just put a series of injections around the urethra, around the pipe that you pass water through, to tighten that up. And by tightening that up, then when the patient coughs or sneezes, there's a barrier there that prevents that leakage. But it will open when you want to naturally void, it's closed for the rest of the time. The great advantage of the injections is the speed of recovery. As I said earlier, normally two days after the injections you're back to normal. I will then follow patients up at about six weeks to see how they're getting on and 70% of patients will come back and say one session has been enough, one treatment has been enough and they are now doing the things they felt they couldn't do before. If they're not in that 70%, if they haven't quite got enough, we have other options. We can repeat the injections if we need to tighten it slightly more and again that's a very simple process. Or for the more major forms of incontinence, we can go on to more major forms of surgery. And again, the injections has not caused any problems with going on to more major forms. So it's a fantastic place to start if you're looking for a surgical option. For any patient that was a bit anxious about this and a bit scared to come forward, I would say this is a simple procedure. There are no cuts involved. This is all done through a telescope uh, with a small injection. It's a day case procedure and you're back to normal within 24 or 48 hours. You're quickly back to doing all your normal activities and often things you haven't done for years. It doesn't stop you going on to have a more major procedure if you're thinking about that and there's a good chance this will prevent you needing that more major procedure.